Hello everyone, this is East Dragon, and welcome back to another episode of Fire Emblem Heroes. So, kind of forgot it was Water Week, so we got to get this done. Uh, team, okay. Floor is gonna be a problem as we have no defense tiles. Fiorm is our best matchup against her, because then she only gets debuffed by five defense. Actually, le even less if we buff her up, but okay, let's see. That means we probably want Fiorm trying to handle Camilla here. Orders, please. And we need to be able to outspeed, or just like not get doubled, basically. Alright, that's pretty decent. I'm um, pretty comfortable with just chilling back and getting just all the unnecessary buffs. Get the exact kill there, that's pretty good. Uh, Roy is our next target. Probably... Uh, yeah, I probably want Corn to do that. So you want to save this ether for Flora, if possible. Alright, get that debuff on him. Buff up for defense and speed while we're at it. That's not speed. Oh well. It's fine, we can hit one turn. You shouldn't be able to one shot or do anything weird with Dragon Bind, so we'll be fine there. Um. Now it's just Hector versus Corn probably. Here so we're gonna go. do this. Let's go. And take them out like that. Uh yes. buff for defense, because why not? That's gonna hurt. Definitely not something we can't handle though. I'm gonna pop Orders. that ether. And now we check how much damage we can do to Flora, quite a bit, so we can actually just probably multi-attack her with units and just one round KO. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Just making sure we don't get attack smoked there. So, alright. It's a decent second match. I'll take it. Uh, this current night, it's, it's been absolutely terrible, been fishing for hours, <laughs> no luck whatsoever, so I am ridiculously brain dead right now. I'm thinking Marv would, will cut it, uh, because he can hit like in the 90s in attack, so as long as he doubles, he'll be fine. Uh, these two buddies, thinking... We can get Raven to do it, but the problem is he can't proc his Glimmer because of Special Fighter. So, if we buff his attack to 62, 74, 27 times 24. So he'll be short uh, on the kill. Unless we can get Marf and more people to buff. There's no panic ploy, so that's fine. Uh, don't exactly like the fact that we're gonna have to, uh, that'll be fine. And we'll use Baruka for support here. We don't need any support like Alencia for attacking, so this will be fine. Trademark. That is Special Fighter, not Bold Fighter, so we can definitely try and export that. Use Baruka for runaway support, basically. Now at this point, we probably just want to run to the other side like this, and we'll be fine like that. We'll just do this to be extra. So yep, I calculated that out already. Not a big deal. can flip that, and we'll do that. Should be okay from this point on. He's the one, he, they both have armor march here. So it's not great. We can take him out, double repo. 
can repel like this and use Baruka to repel. Heal up Marv. Easy. Desperation kill. And take him out. So that wasn't too bad. Did use two pretty decent units though, so that's not great. But we'll make it work. Sim 52 is great. This team is nasty as heck. Uh, our key to winning here is just taking out Azura as early as we can, aka hopefully turn one. So that's the plan. Uh, so we basically exploit the fact that there's rally up attack. So she'll be able to do some meaningful amount of damage to Hector to the point where she won't dance. Uh, we could even add more salts by debuffing his res if he really wanted to do that, but we're not going to do that. Um, our options against these buddies though are not great at all, especially Aversa. We don't have much going our way. Um, what can we do here? We could... Alright, we'll, we'll bring Mist, even though having an adjacent ally is absolutely counterintuitive, so let's not. <laughs> let's not do that if we can. Let's, well, Azura's not going to do much better, actually. I don't know why I'm caring so about... Oh, uh, this is fine. We can get some drives going. Was that 35 versus 52? It should be fine. Trademark. Um, yeah, I'm mostly just concerned about keeping his health up. Defense tactic is useless, so we'll just do this. Um, just hypothetically, he can handle these two. Versus a little iffy, but it's definitely possible. Um, uh, actually a 58 attack. No, yeah, we can get enough bulk for that. It's mostly just Summer Young Tiki right now. So I'm thinking probably Sharina for the 1v1. I forgot to equip a better special on Sharina, but whatever. We'll work with it. So our key is turn one, we're just going to go aggro and uh, bait like this. And we'll have mist down here to be more flexible if we need, if need be. I'm just going to hit end turn and we're going to debuff and all that good stuff. And Azura is going to attack and get herself murdered, which is exactly what we want. Now we have this Aversa here, so now we just gotta run everyone away. She's only gonna have up to, was that, 69 attacks, so we should be fine here. Three to mark, no guidance, only Wings of Mercy on Aversa. So we get the, not quite the kill, which is not great. But, we can definitely attack and repo with Sharina. That's exactly what we're gonna do. And heal up Hector. Get the rally there. Get the attack smoke off, we get the exact kill. Definitely rigged. And we should be able to just auto wall. No problem. He can't double us. And even if he dead, doesn't have enough attack, so... Pretty clean AI cheese there. Uh, 746 is disastrous for us, but we'll make it work. Uh, hmm. Tempted to use Brave Ike. <laughs> I don't. I don't think it's a good idea. Let's. Let's not. Hmm. Hmm. Kind of concerned about this. <laughs> uh, it'll be fine. What's the worst that could happen? Cap. <laughs> Alright, let's see. We need someone to attack chill attack creep uh, because we are not getting an immediate bait there. 
We're basically just gonna be stalling with Ignis. That's the strat. Um, Fallen Techie is gonna be a nightmare to deal with. 42 speed tops though does mean we can't outspeed with people. That's not a concern. Well, we could just try to brute force, but let's see. That'd be like 79 attack tops. And no, we are doing like nothing <laughs> with that. Uh, so effective damage it is. Our options are pretty limited. Could use Matt or Legendary Marf here. Or could use Mass Marf. We're going to go with this guy and we're good at our life decisions later. Bring a Dancer for sure. And look what healers we got. Oh, I forgot to put Savage Blow on Jenny. I just like stopped putting on seals for some reason. I don't know why. I gotta. I keep forgetting to go back and actually, you know. <laughs> now let's do this. This team seemed decent. Let's see, we got coverage for... We basically have coverage on everyone. We could technically charge it. Okay. Problem is that special fighter either, but... We'll give it our best shot here. Um, my ideas on how we're going to approach this team. I should have buffed his speed with Brad Ninny. Doesn't matter anymore. So, let's see. Let's do this. I like this idea. Um, we will be able to double thanks to Binding Shield. Okay, uh, we're actually just going to have leg er, not Legendary Hector, LA Hector tank a couple of hits here. I'll be fine. There's nothing to worry about. She can't counterattack. We're just accelerating our Ignis to speed up this process here. Because otherwise, this is going to take a while. There we go. So now we got Thunder Armades coming in. Let's just do this. And camp. That's all we're gonna do. Just sit and camp. <laughs> and just stall to death, pretty much. Or that. That works too. Just keep hitting and turn. The most optimal strategy, boys. Easy. Oh my gosh, we're getting absolutely memed now. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's see what we got. I'm thinking Nephany here. That'll be pretty good. When's Brand's gonna suck? Is that speed faint? Yeah, speed faint. That's not great. Nasala's gonna be a pain. A real pain. Holy cow. How do we deal with him? Uh, we might just have to. Ping him with like a may a range unit. So I don't think I want to try and melee this guy because of Gale Force. Because he's 100 percent proccing Gale Force on us. Uh, I'm definitely probably likely to double. It's on this map, which is not great. But we can make this work for sure. Um, so if we use Lewin, for example, 49. Yeah, we, we are super short from doubling. So, we would need to ping him twice and get the heck out of there. But how we would do that is beyond me. Uh, we could actually probably force the AI, now that I think about it. So yeah, let's do that. So we're definitely bringing... Do we nest? I, I think we have to bring Luin. Uh, let's bring Azura, I guess. Young Azura. Actually, we can bring someone else. 49, 53. Yeah, we're gonna be short. So, uh, playing it aggressive is probably pretty good. 
What is that? 54, 60, 48. Who's chill attack hitting? Nephany? Alright, that's okay. Not great, but we'll make it work. And we'll put... And this is better. Alright, I don't necessarily like this team, but it'll work. It'll work. So, our plan, we're just going to manipulate the AI by putting Lewin in range of Nasala. Well, not in range, but Raven King Beak, he's not going to be able to transform because Sheet is here. So we're going to manipulate the AI. And, oh wait, I forgot. I kind of need to manipulate the AI so he actually <laughs> comes to Lewin. Oops. Uh, this should be fine. What could possibly go wrong, am I right? Alright, this is going fantastic if I've ever seen <laughs> Oh boy, what am I doing? What is this? <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing anymore. Can Lewin just kill Soren? 58. No. Oh, this is so great, isn't it? Uh, we can get out of here. It's just how do I want to get out of here? Uh, that... That into that. So, like... Wait, no. I don't want to do that. This into... This into this into this. <laughs> sure. This will work out, trust me. <laughs> Oh man, what is this? Well, all right. Really? Yep, really? What is this? Oh my gosh. Only if you're good. So I'm thinking here, this right here, there. Oh wait, that doesn't kill me, so <laughs> what am I doing? No. So that assumes Zer doesn't get doubled, which she doesn't. She always just gets straight up murdered though. Right? Is that 46? So then... 55? Yeah, she's dead. RIP. What am I doing? <laughs> oh my gosh. What have I gotten myself into? Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and Lightning Charmless. Like the casual, I, <laughs> I cannot think right now, so we're just not going to. Only if you're good. All right, we're gonna do this. All right. This is fine. Really? All of this All is right. fine. We should be able to kill here, and it's just Zephyl versus Nephany. I think is a trivial matchup because of Dauntless Lance. Alright, that was messy, but we'll keep going. He's, I do see the score is pretty decent, so I'm gonna stick with it. Okay, this map's absolutely terrible. We gotta murder these guys as quick as you've ever seen them come to town. But how we're gonna do that beats me. Um... I think it's gonna have to be a battle of attrition. Uh, that's that's what it's looking like. We're gonna go all out, I think. Use legendaries. It's not really all out, but the idea is we're gonna definitely need the cheese. We could actually probably just get away with Jenny cheese. Um, 
I'd rather not try that though, so we're gonna bring some form of dragon slaying with us here. So we have some options. We have Krom, which I think I have to bring. Let's see. What could possibly go wrong with this team? Am I right? Or am I right? <laughs> oh, this is so silly. Um, I think we can just have Genuine Patron ones. Sealed Felching, all that good stuff. Alright. They're taking their time. Not great. Demonic Breath, Rally Attack Speed for 37. Uh, that would be the 60. Should be fine. I see no reason why Krom can't handle this. And then proceeds to get casually doubled. <laughs> because I wasn't paying attention about something. Alright, there's that. So far, so good. We have our Luna ready, which is nice. Let's see if we can greet. We can actually greet the Surter Kill. That's nice. Um. Let's do this. Okay. Manipulate some AI. AI cheese OP. So now we're going to we're bait Canigus with the one and only uh, Fang Linus. Justice. Fang Justice. Looks like we didn't need to Jenny cheese because I forgot. We, well, I think Jenny did play a role here. You just you didn't really. It wasn't very obvious. But Jenny Cheese here, way too strong. You can't beat Jenny Cheese, man. We'll give Krom the kill. If he did get that clutch kill on Surter, having like 70 attack is pretty helpful. And last match here, of course, it's a nasty matchup. That's where we have Mass Marf to kind of help out. And at this point, we definitely need a Dancer. And we're just pretty much in a bad spot. So we gotta figure out how to do this. Uh, biggest problem, of course, is Nasala. We're gonna deal with him. Surge's probably gonna be a big problem too, honestly. I was thinking mono, mono like this. But I don't know how I think about this. Or what I think about this. So let's see, we can get 53, 58, 47. And 5 damage is not getting in into brazen range. So... We're going to have to do some really cheeky things we're going to do that. Um... We'll work with it. I think this is our best option. I say that, but this is just... Ugh. I'm gonna do this. This is probably a bad play. I think going after Nisala is the better play. But we don't ever do the better play. We just do the bad play. So... <laughs> um... I'm thinking about just giving her the defense tile. I'm just gonna compute the damage, honestly. It's probably worth it. 52 on a defense tile is 67 defense versus our 75. Should be fine. Trademark. Alright. There's that. Okay, Nasala no longer can transform. That is fantastic. Um Surter though. Yes. Oh no. Let's go. Can she live a hit zero? <laughs> Negative. I can give it a shot. Celica here. Let's attack like this. Okay. Yes. 
Draw back. Pop the shot. Um, okay, let's think. This is fine if we do this, right? I kind of inclined to think not. This actually legitimately matters. What is this? The starter goes here, and he slowly does something like, yeah, I'm pretty sure he's going this way, because uh, Selic is very squishy, but um, let's see. I think we are going to do this. This is risky. We're going to do this. We get the rally. Amazing. That just straight up might clutch it out for us. Because Nasala, one, two, three, can't reach. On, so let's go. Brazen attack speed, and the refine, and the refine, and the refine for the win. So we get our lightning charm back, and we get a measly 5280, which is going to drop. So unfortunately, I'm probably not going to be able to get the uh, top 1k run on camera because I've already spent like three hours rolling and like two of those hours we're trying to get the first match <laughs> so uh we'll see what happens but that's gonna be it for this episode thanks for watching as always this is youth dragon and hope to see you all next time bye